Hey guys, I got a new browser extension for you made by Link Research Tools. And guess what? It's about links. All things links and this is the new link checker. When you click on this new icon, the LRT link checker opens up and scans the website and checks all those links. And this just happened on my homepage. You can see we take this seriously and we check for external links, same root domain links, internal links, broken links, unverified links, follow links, no follow links. And you can use this extension then to review your own page links. We show you the power trust of where the link is going to, the actual source code, the HTML source code, where you often find, you know, little details about you know, what the linker thought he would do. So beware if your links have a CSS class saying paid link, for example. But of course, this is so much more powerful. You can uh, export the links in a whole separate interface that I want to explain really, really quick. You got the different statuses, broken, unverified. Of course, on this case, we only got OK links. And then you can say, what are the external domain links or what are the same root domain links? So I now selected same root domain, which means it's linkresearchtools.com. So all the links to app.linkresearchtools, jobs.linkresearchtools.com, all the different help and the e-help and the Netherlands help and the Polish help and all these are listed here. It's only a few compared to the 100 links or so that we saw before and I can further restrict here by follow no follow and I can maybe say I only want to have those with help in the uh, in the in the in the line yeah, so you can uh, wildcard search here which is super super handy to find for instance links to PDFs or broken links to PDFs or broken no follow links to PDFs yeah and this gets more important and even more interesting when we go to a Wikipedia page. So here, El Dorado, Texas already prepared and you see this little uh, two, the red two icon here says we got two broken links here. Out of the 600 from 582 follow links and 18 no follow links, we got two broken links and we can click on that and zoom right there. This is where, where you could potentially build links. I'm sure you know that that link, uh, Wikipedia, that link, linking method. So this is how you do it. On the Four Nations Cup side uh, page, it's the same thing. It's 19 broken links. When you look at that, the broken links actually start here in the 2018 link because I guess the 2018 page wasn't even created. And going further, you just zoom through all those broken links through the page and you see this is how you can find them in addition to of course having a color coding and what you might notice is um, most of these links are internal and some of them are no follow of course we can highlight the no follow links on the page and of course if we have unverified links uh, let's see do we have unverified links yes one this link here, we probably hit on too fast or maybe we ju were just blocked because we visited as a bot. So we're going to turn that off and we're going to make that interval for crawling a little bit slower. And then we just reload the page, go here and start it all again. You see how all these follow, no follows get marked immediately. All these external links here obviously have the no follow marker in addition to the working link. And yeah, as you see, you know, this is running for a bit, still on the follow and the broken links and the unverified links we try to recheck more often. Ah, look at this. We got broken external links and we got broken internal links now. Where are the broken internal links? Ah, here we got one. Here we got another one. So this goes to a Wikipedia page that is broken. And it gets even better. If we look at here uh, vanilla Coke, which I never liked, but uh, I hear some people drink this. Uh, we got these external links, Coca-Cola Co New Zealand to some weird um, default page. And we got an original that is broken with 
a web archive link about the product descriptions from back then in 2012. Well, the 2012 URL doesn't exist anymore and Wikipedia sometimes keeps this uh, uh, in there as a broken link intentionally. Having a 404 in the middle of a page here for Commando Delta is of course not something interesting. And if you look at all these pages here, it looks like someone prepared pages for this whole organization and never implemented, I mean, never wrote about it. And did you know that there is an article, uh, I mean, a page on Wikipedia that just lists all the broken links? I think they maintain it manually. It has 429. And this is just a sub page of it for the, that external links from October 2012. And when we look at that, and you know, from the 429, we're still hitting on the broken and the unreferred links a little bit slower, just like in link research tools where it takes longer for the actual uh, broken and verified links to verify if they're really broken or if we just get timeouts and errors. We got an internal broken link here. So this directory of pages about broken links even has broken links, yeah? which is kind of funny meter, isn't it? Yeah, and again, to make clear the most useful function for all of you is probably getting this all exported. Getting all the broken links or only the unverified links to external pages. And yeah, look at those and see if you can um, edit it to some better content. Your content. Okay. Yeah, I hope this demonstration was interesting and I wish you a lot of fun and success with the new LRT link checker.